Ukraine's strike created a shock effect. Russia did not expect it. Ukraine has declared Russia's largest seaports unsafe for shipping after attacks on Russian ships. Thus, Ukraine has gained a strong leverage for negotiations with Russia because the blockade of ports is extremely painful for Moscow. This is stated in the material of RBC Ukraine. Ukraine has made the six largest ports of the aggressor Anapa, Novorossiysk, Belensik, Twaps, Sochi and Tama dangerous for shipping. In other words, Ukraine announced that the strikes will continue. This is primarily a signal to foreign ship operators and insurance companies, be prepared for losses if you continue to come to these ports, the article states. In fact, Ukraine has begun to respond to Moscow with a mirror effect because Ukrainian ports have been blockaded by Russia for more than a year. This will be extremely painful for Russia because its trade through Black Sea ports is estimated at 100 billion US dollars a year. The blockade of Russian ports gives Ukraine a strong leverage to fulfill its demands, including the liberation of its territory and compensation for the damage caused. The most important thing is that Ukraine got the opportunity to completely remove the blockade of the ports for the export of not only grain, but all types of cargo. Negotiations on unlocking will now be held on equal terms. Ukraine should not weaken the pressure, but should continue it despite the possible aggression of Russia, the source writes. In an interview with Latin American media, Ukrainian president Volodymyr Zelensky stated that Russian ships could face destruction if the Kremlin continues its assault on Ukrainian ports, according to La Nación. Zelensky highlighted that Russia's blockade of the Black Sea, including Ukraine's territorial waters, requires Ukraine to assert its right to import and export goods within its territorial waters. If Russia continues to dominate its territory in the Black Sea and blockading, firing missiles, then Ukraine will do the same which is a fair protection of our chances. If they keep firing, we don't have as many weapons, but if they keep shooting by the end of the war, they may be without a ship. And this is what we want to show you, emphasized Zelensky.